Hello and welcome back to the channel. Today we are going to be talking about how to level up in Call of Duty Vanguard multiplayer faster. Before we get started with today's video, make sure you head down and click the subscribe button to keep up to date with everything that is happening on the channel. Also, make sure you head over to Twitter, Instagram and TikTok to check out everything that is happening over there. Anyway, now that the plug for the channel is over, let's get going. So the first thing you need to know about Call of Duty Vanguard is that there are different levels for you to progress through. First of all, you have the basic 55 levels that everyone works their way through until you hit prestige after level 55. This is not something you really need to worry about for now, as you level up you will unlock various weapons, perks and calling cards for you to use in Vanguard, but this isn't too important yet. You can advance up these levels by gaining experience points in a number of ways. Once you reach level 55 you'll notice that you are then in prestige. In Vanguard there are 5 different prestiges for you to progress through which you can do by just playing the game. In previous versions of Call of Duty you had to go on manually prestige which resulted in you losing all your weapons and perks and having to level up from level 1 all the way to level 50 or 55 or 100 depending on what the top rank in each individual Call of Duty game was and this would repeat for each prestige that you progress through. This year it is easier than ever to level up fast and to get to the prestiges in a couple of days or a couple of weeks depending on how much time you actually have. First of all, the easiest way that you can level up is by just playing the game. I know this sounds like an easy suggestion but it really is the most basic way to get experience and level up. For each game you play you will get a raw score that you have earned in the game through kills and eliminations and all that kind of thing. You then get a series of boosters which can be things you have completed in that game. These give a massive boost to your experience and prioritising them can see you level up really really fast. The second thing that can make you level up really fast is the challenges that you can complete in Call of Duty Vanguard. Challenges are split into different sections as you can see here. In each of these sections there are different types of challenges. Some focus on the basics of Call of Duty like the bootcamp challenges while others are a bit more sophisticated and harder to complete like these challenges in the precision tab. If you look at each of these challenges you can see that you get rewarded with experience when you complete them meaning that as soon as you complete a challenge you earn experience which will be added to your score in game to give you a heap of experience which will see you level up really fast. You also get some pretty cool calling cards and emblems too for completing these challenges so it really is a win win. The third thing I would recommend you to focus on to level up quicker is weapon challenges. I feel this is quite an overlooked thing and lots of people just play with a few weapons and never really play with the vast amount of weapons Call of Duty Vanguard has to offer, which is a shame. Each weapon in Call of Duty Vanguard has a whole load of challenges. Here is my STG44 which I have been using from the beginning of Vanguard. As you can see there are 10 different challenges which I can complete for the STG44, all of which unlock camo for your weapon and also give you experience. This is such an important detail as each challenge that you can see on the screen now has within it 10 tiers. All of these tiers give you experience when you complete them. Let's take a look at this first challenge for the STG44. You need to get 5 kills without dying 30 times at tier 10. However, if we go back to tier 1, this challenge is much easier as you only need to get 5 kills without dying 3 times which is much more manageable. For doing this you get 250 experience points, at tier 2 you get 500 experience points and so on until you hit tier 10 when you get 5000 experience points. If we add up all of the experience you can get for completing these 10 tiers you come out with 23,250 experience points for completing one set of weapon challenges. That's just one set. As you can see there are 10 of these general challenges each of which have 10 tiers in them, meaning that for the STG44 in Call of Duty Vanguard, you can gain a massive total of 2,325,000 experience points just for completing all of the challenges here. That's a lot of math, so I hope it's right. Um, it's not really my strong suit. This is legitimately a cheat code for leveling up fast in Call of Duty Vanguard, and this is something you should be focusing on. My fourth tip for leveling up fast in Call of Duty Vanguard is paying attention to tokens and events. In the battle pass you can unlock different tokens. It doesn't matter if you have paid for the full battle pass or you just have the free version, you will still get the chance to unlock tokens to use in game. There are a number of tokens you can use in game including double experience tokens for different times and double weapon experience for different times. These tokens say exactly what they do. 
and they can make a huge difference to the experience you earn in Call of Duty Vanguard, and this cannot be overlooked. At the time of recording this video, we are currently in the Festive Fervor event which means that Call of Duty Vanguard is giving every player double experience points for the entirety of the event, which means that now is the perfect time to get levelled up. My final tip for levelling up quickly in Call of Duty is by just having fun. The best way to level up for me is just to ignore the numbers and play the game in your own way. Whether you like to run about like a maniac or just take it slow and camp, as long as you are having fun and enjoying the game then you will level up through your base score and any boosts that you get by an accident through playing the game. I hope that this video has helped you level up faster and I hope that you can get to prestige as quickly as possible. If this video has helped make sure you comment with what you think the best way to level up is and don't forget to like it down below as well so other people who need the help can see this video. Also, don't forget to subscribe to the channel to see other Call of Duty Vanguard content coming very soon. For now though, thanks for watching and I will leave you with some gameplay of me in Call of Duty Vanguard.